Hi everyone, uh, this uh, uh, journal page that I'm going to do is for uh, Nina Raibina's journal probes and more. It's the Facebook group, I will leave a link below uh, to the group. And the theme of this month is uh, friendship and I'm going to make it in my junk trash a book that is coming apart where I mostly do experimenting but I don't know why I've decided that I want to do the the prompt here uh, the only thing I've done uh, so far is just uh, glued a uh, masking tape here to reinforce the two pages and so I won't have a uh, paint leakage to other pages and I'm not going to gesso uh, these pages because I'm going to use uh, these acrylics that are quite thick so I don't feel the need to uh, prime uh, the pages these are local brands so I don't have any name for you <sighs> Okay. I'm starting uh, I'm taking a sponge and starting with the lighter color and I'm going to uh, soak a little bit my sponge with water. It helps uh, spreading the paint and blending. I'm not uh, thinking where I'm putting it, I'm just spreading it around. In short while the other uh, colors will join it and uh, it will start to make uh, sense. I think the only thing, I, I'm not planning it, but there is kind of directionality that helps I, uh, uh, the page being more uh, cohesive. I didn't plan it, just going uh, basically for me it's from right to left and if you can see it. I want a little bit more blending between colors so I'm going in with a lighter uh, cream color Yeah, I like it. 
Okay. Uh, I need my notebook for leftover paint. Never waste paint. Okay, finished with the paint. Okay, I'm going to give it a little uh, to dry it with the heating tool. got here two tissue paper that I've stamped uh, with the uh, stamps that I have and I'm going to glue this down here and after it's dry I will uh, trim the, the edges so I need glue got stuck All glue. I want it sealed. It's a lot of glue and it will take a while to dry even with the heat tool but it's better doing it now than regret it later without sealing it. Okay, so I am stopping for now. I will uh, dry, wait for it to dry or try uh, making it dry faster <laughs> and I'll come back. And I'm back. It's dry and I'm kind of a... Uh, uh, like the break, the background but i still think it needs more color and uh, before i'm uh, going to add general color to all the page i'm just going around the edges with my sponge 
so at least uh, there will be some kind of frame to this page cutting a little piece of sponge Okay, I think the middle just popped up uh, by giving more definition to the edges. Again, using the excess paint. So I printed these two silhouettes from, from the internet and I'm going to fussy cut them and I'm going to place them on uh, the page and we'll see what happens. I'm going to fussy cut it and then come back. And I'm back. So I fussy cut the, the silhouettes but as I went along I've changed the silhouettes so uh, they would be different. I didn't want them to be like twins and I uh, went over the edges with black uh, acrylic paint so there won't be leftover white from the printer page. Now uh, basically I want to place them here but I feel like I need to to have more elements with this kind of purple on the background so I'm uh, taking them aside and I have this ink pad. It's not exactly the same color, but I think it will echo the edges. At least I hope so. So I'm adding, of course, a more butterflies to my page, to the background. They are not uh, quite pronounced, but it will give another uh, detail even if uh, most of it will be covered uh, with the silhouettes I prefer I also uh, I always prefer to make a very uh, layered and detailed background without uh, considering what will be covered uh, I prefer it uh, to be very detailed and if it will get covered uh, afterwards with another layer I don't care.
אוקיי. So now I'm going to uh, glue this down. I'm going to use a glue stick. want anything to be messed so I'm gonna use this the notebook lots and lots of glue especially around the edges I'm always worried about being in frame, especially that my uh, phone camera decides to zoom in as she as she likes. I don't. I haven't found any function that can, I can control the zoom in, so I have to deal with what I have. to uh, go over here with the, the sponge because I don't like that uh, the, silhouette, the silhouette here is so pronounced the black line I'm not trying to hide it completely just a little bit uh, of blending okay so now I want to put some writing in here I kept thinking about a song you've got a friend and I like a uh, especially several lines in the song so I'm going to put them here in the middle and you don't need to see my <laughs> how I struggle with my penmanship so I'm going to write it and come back I'm back so I tried writing but uh, whatever I've done it just blended with the background so I went in with the uh, two lighter colors that I've used the cream and uh, I don't know what to call it blush I think and went all around here and only when it uh, got dried I uh, wrote what I wanted to write winter spring summer or fall all you have to do is call and I'll be there you've got a friend so this, this is my page for uh, this week's uh, prompt. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to Madrid, uh, as I told you before. And when I'll come back, I have a challenge basically for myself. I want to make an art journal uh, from scratch and I'm going to use only household uh, items. And basically I would love if you will join me and I want to really make it uh, from start to finish like if I want to gesso 
some page then I'm going to make the JSO on ordinary record nothing is going to be off record or I'll be back so each uh, part of making the journal will be recorded and uh, basically I'm, I'm going to use a newspaper a printer paper a white glue a glue stick a magazine paper and basically and the acrylic paints and felt pens I don't think and the household items in general so I'll be back in about uh, I don't know a week and a half and I'll be seeing you if you like what I've done please give me a thumbs up and I love when you leave the uh, comments below so bye for now